Okay, welcome back to Zadi Bly Podcast. I'm with Nick Allen on the, the case that was just decided that many of the laws passed in Klantan, they are not valid. Quashed. Because, quashed <laughs> because they violated, they go against the principles of our constitution. Okay, Nick. Now this uh, case, of course, obviously has uh, put you under a lot of pressure. I'm sure. You know? Very. But I'm sure your family very supportive. Alhamdulillah, mm. I, my mum is very supportive. But as I said, this um, she only knew about. She, we didn't tell anybody actually when we first initiated oh, okay. it. You know mm. because. We thought it's just going to be something quiet. <laughs> mm. We, I expected it to blow up, but I asked my, I got my mother's blessings first, and she said, "Are you sure this?" Is? Yes, I said. So I explained to her, and she's eighty-four now, and so she says, "Yeah, uh, hopefully." She's eighty-four now. Yes, oh. she's eighty-four now, and so that's she's good. I'm very, I'm very proud of her. Alhamdulillah. Yeah. So she said, uh, "If you think that is right, then do it." You know, mm. and she knows I'm. If it's not right. She knows that I will stand up and speak, you know. But sometimes my children say, "Tone down, mummy, tone down." You're so, you know. You're How many children do you have? I have five. Five, mm. okay. And they all say tone down. And they're all very overprotective. Okay. Oh my, my. Well, son, fair enough. Over, yeah, overprotective about me. So, I said, "Mummy, be careful, be careful. Everything is be careful." But, you know, when you have this fighter inside of you, you know, it's very hard to control me. Mm. <laughs> no, I think it's good because we have to believe in something. Mm. And I speak up for a lot of matters. Yeah, in, in everything, you yes. know. Uh, I, I know what it's like. Mm. and uh, But it's glad I'm glad that your family is with you and all that. Now, why is it that I noticed someone today commented, a former judge, mm. uh, he said that procedurally this is not correct. Because the attorney general, he was not involved. Mm -hmm. uh, can you give your take on this? Okay, now, to be honest, I haven't read much because I've been stressed out with a lot of things. So, but <laughs> um, I didn't stress you, did I? <laughs> no, <laughs> uh, not yet. <laughs> this is just the second one. But um, the thing is... I, I, if there's one thing that I agreed with the dissenting um, argument was that the federal government should have come in and sued the state government instead of me. It should have been the federal government suing the state government for the, for the, uh, for the fact that they were incompetent and it's under the federal list and the state should not you know, ultra-virus, the, the, yes, yes, yes. the list that they're allowed to. So it should have been done, it should have been initiated by the federal government, mm. the AGC. But the AGC uh, did nothing till the end. That's why I came in, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but when you, even when you initiated the case, mm. did they come in to intervene, no? No, they did not. It's very strange, isn't it? I don't know. We, we have to ask them. I won't speculate what they, <laughs> what was on what were was on their minds. Maybe I don't know. Yeah, because this to is be, to play safe. Maybe. Well, we have a lot of people play safe, in there, mm -hmm. but but this is obviously a clear uh, an issue involving the constitution. Mm -hmm. I would have thought the attorney general would be interested. To be populist, I don't know. Oh. I don't know. I, well, maybe, I have no idea. Maybe he was told not to. Maybe I don't know. <laughs> But we have a new age anyway. Mind. Let's <laughs> not speculate. Because this is enough. Mm. Now, what I think, uh, what is the, is there any reaction from your, you know, normally the bar council is very high. Oh, yes. Alhamdulillah. The bar oh, council what did they say? I didn't they, know. They're very supportive. Oh. They're, they're, they, they are, they are. They never supported me. How come? <laughs> <laughs> okay, never mind. They, 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 they did. Um, they're one of the parties who, I think they're, um, Amicus Curie, I, th I think so. I think oh, the bar council yes, is yes. friends of the court. Yes. Oh, mm. okay. Yeah, so not sure which party now, which party, but I know they they did. But in 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 the the newspapers, did they come up openly to support you? Uh no. But they did send a rap gun, so that's good enough. No, no. But what I want to know: do they say anything now? 
No, not yet. Not yet? Not yet. Oh. I'm waiting, maybe. Hmm. But so, the back council pun ada selective. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm very close to them. Yeah, I know. So. That's what I'm telling, <laughs> I'm telling them through you. So, hmm. so okay. I'll, I'll tell Karen afterwards. Oh, it's a lightning. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> I'm sure. But never mind, that's personal. But, uh, uh, okay, aside from the back council, do you have like any... Malay political parties that has expressed sympathy for you or support your yes, position? Yes, yes. Oh. Because this has become a political issue. Hmm. So I see a lot of a lot of support. I don't know whether I should say it, but Amana has been very supportive of me. Oh. Yeah, well, except for this morning when I saw the headline saying that I should have fought, uh, found a more harmonious way. I'm wondering what harmonious way. Hmm. But, but the members of Amana, you know, have been very supportive. I was, oh. I was thrown into the... Because it's... It is to their benefit. Yeah, it's because Hamana, as yes. far as I remember, they always describe themselves as like reformists, mm. Muslim reformists. Yes. So, so they so should support you. They right? gain from this, you know, oh. the fact that it shows how past has failed. So are you friends of Masabu then? Not yet. Oh, <laughs> you <laughs> should get to me. know him. I don't know. <laughs> I know him well before. Yeah, I knew him well, but okay. not now. Introduce me to him. Because minister, you know, it's difficult to see them. Oh, you know. yes. But I'm glad that Amana supports you. Alhamdulillah. Ah, that's good. Uh, mm. But Abno? So far, siapa ya? Tak ada senyap macam you rasa. Ah, <laughs> Abno ni kadang-kadang orang yang sepatut disokong, dia tak sokong. Tak orang yang tak patut disokong, dia sokong. Oh, by the way, just to correct lah, <laughs> takut-takut orang Amana terasa pula. It's members in the, in the Amana group lah. I'm in a WhatsApp chat group. group yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. The I, I am sure the the more yang berani ni orang bawah lah. Hmm, Lalu ni orang atas, atas ni. Atas-atas tak ada lagi uh, cakap the, apa-apa. Uh, orang atas ni dia tengok dia tengok tanda-tanda. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, wind, how how the winds tak? blow. How yeah, the winds blow. Ada keselamat huh? tak? Uh, uh, yeah. So, <laughs> okay, but, but nobody from the top Achilles of Amana has come to support. Oh, the, the orang tengok dia tunggu signal from the Prime Minister <laughs> I suppose. <laughs> So I'm also waiting for the Prime Minister to stand on this. Oh, he said it's nothing to do with the... It's nothing to do... In fact, he said... No, what did he say, actually? No, okay, what I read, okay, um, is that uh, the one who initiated... This is a, a person from Kelantan, and uh, and that I'm a member of Muafakat National. So, so I push aside, okay... Yeah, I am a member of Muafakat National. But I thought Muafakat National was not a political party. You know, Muafakat National is is like peace, love, unity, you know. So I thought that was a good... Um, so he wasn't supporting you, lah. He was trying to distance himself. Mm. Oh. Mm. That's a disappointment. <laughs> but anyway, I hope the Prime Minister will make a clearer stand on this issue. You know, the world is waiting for reaction from him. I'm sure. You know. I yeah, but he said he's got nothing to do. It's a well. We have to understand. No, of it's course he's got something to do. How can you say <laughs> that? Here, here is an issue of constitutional importance. Mm. The least he should do is say, "I am happy that the court has reaffirmed it." <laughs> I would have said that if I'm prime minister. <laughs> but never. Mind. To okay. Yeah. Okay. The other thought that I want to raise with you is the issue mm-hmm. of uh, women's welfare generally. Mm-hmm. You know, you see the Sharia court thing mm. because it's personal law. Yes. Involves issues of marriage, yes. divorce, issue of uh, estate, issue of uh, wakaf, issue mm-hmm. of zakka, issue mm-hmm. of all these mm-hmm. things. Now, the Sharia court in this country. As, as you know, mm. there's always been male-dominated system. Mm. Well, there are some window dressings. Yeah, <laughs> but generally. <laughs> generally, yeah. Uh, why can't they uh, you know, bring in more women into the system to make the system more progressive, more sensitive to the needs of the riot? Why don't they do that? I think we're still in the patriarchal system. We are in the patriarchal system. Yeah. yeah. So, so I think... well. As I said just now, there's a lot of window dressing. There are female judges now. Okay, but when you go to court and you see the the decisions that are delivered by the women judges are not always for the women themselves, you know. So it still takes a long time to get a divorce. and still takes a long time to get custody. Yeah. You know, but 
Alhamdulillah, our Minister of Religion, Datuk Naim, he has meant when he was in Shah Alam, he, he did the uh, fast track of the divorce, so that helped. So, but that's only if, if if the husband agrees, lah. You know, and I noticed that in in Wilaya, uh, if let's say you have um, a divorce coming in, like other states, what I notice, I'm not very familiar now, um, is that if let's say um, you have a divorce case with a custody case, with a uh, with a Hartus Pancharan case, you mm. have all of these cases. Each file has got its own different um, court. Okay, so Hadana comes into the High Court of Sharia, Sharia High Court. Okay, divorce is Mahkamah Rendah. So it takes Sharia. a long time. No, but wilaya, wilaya, kalau you have a hard Hadana issue, right? They immediately bring all the files into the same court. So that means that when a husband who wants to apply for Hadana in the in the um, courts, right? Masa mula-mula dia kata, okay, masa nak nak uh, dapat cerai tu, dia kata, oh, saya t- nak bagi nafkah. Because, you know, nafkah, nafkah and Hadana are two different hmm. matters, right? So, they go into the mahkamah rendah to get the nafkah. The husband will say, saya tak mampu nak bagi nafkah, saya tak kerja pun, you know? Hmm. So, they tell Hakim Mahkamah Syariah yang rendah, okay? To say, oh, saya tak mampu. And then they go to the uh, mahkamah to get the hadana. They kata, another judge, which is, which is another judge, and they say, eh, saya ada duit nak. So it's like two different judges listening to... Same case. Same case, but, you know, because there must be... I think the Sharia system has got to improve. Yes, mm. that's what I keep saying. Mm. Ha? Kalau, well, kita nak, kalau kita nak baikkan Islam, mm. ha? benda yang tak berfungsi sekarang mm. dengan baik atau dengan efisiensi yang bagus itu yang kita perlu perbaiki mm. dahulu mm. usah kita nak kembangkan jurisdiction lah mm. kita nak wow-wow ke tentang bangunan. Ha, <laughs> cantikkan bangunan saya tahu saya tahu bangunan mahkamah syariah ni macam mahkamah tinggi mm. juga yes. ya dan kereta-kereta hakim pun dah besar sekarang ni oh, macam yes. dulu zaman saya ya mm. tapi the quality mm. quality penghakiman Sistem yang lebih uh, cepat, lebih efisien. And maybe uniform, Set, maybe nampak. make it a little bit uniform. Yeah, nak uniformity, nak And selaraskan. Mm, selaraskan ya, lah. Proses-proses itu pun tak tak berjalan dengan baik. So kalau misalnya hmm. nak berpoligami, you know, kalau kat Selangor tak dapat, pergi kat Terengganu, pergi kat Perlis, you know, you cannot <laughs> do that. I mean, it yeah. makes the system... Jadi too, benda... Mm. Uh, saya pun tak ada pengalaman poligami ni <laughs> jadi so now you're telling me I should go to Perlis lah <laughs> no no Uzubillah jangan I kenal datin terbuah <laughs> je lah I'm too old to get married yeah. so jadi maksudnya ya lah uniformity yang ni pun kita tak dapat laksanakan mm-hmm. you know why are we talking about expanding jurisdiction but there is hope there is hope I mean it's n- the Sharia courts are necessary you mm. know for Itulah that Datuk mention tadi kan nikah kahwin cerai. Itu uh, no, memang semua. syariah kot mm. boleh sebenarnya Perfungsi. sepatutnya Mm-mm. misi mereka yang menjaga mahkamah mm-hmm. syariah ni sepatutnya mereka buat misi mereka lebih baik sistem tu daripada sistem civil. Yes. Sepatutnya oh, kalau perceraian di mahkamah civil enam tahun atau enam mm. bulan dia mm. boleh buat dalam dua minggu. Betul. Misalnya. Oh. Wow. Wow hebat. I can't imagine. That, that is what is <laughs> ataupun tuntutan yes. itu dan tuntutan yes. ini harta sepencaran mm. ke apa-apa. Kalau suami tak nak bayar ke suami kata mm. saya tak ada duit sebenarnya ditipu mm. misalnya. Mm-hmm. You know? Boleh siasat. Mm. Boleh penyiasatan yang cepat dilakukan yes. misalnya. Jadi kalau kita boleh tunjuk kepada orang Islam sistem kita ni lebih baik. Efficient. Lebih mm. efisien. Lebih adil mm. daripada sistem civil. Mungkin suatu hari nanti you know, orang kata baiklah kita terima Sistem yes. saya. Yes. Ini nak, nak nak laksanakan melalui undang-undang, mm. melalui politik. Mm. Nah, pada saya But itu. But maybe it's because we need a political will to do all of those things. No, dia bukan nak political will. You need rajin. <laughs> <laughs> you need niat baik, mm-hmm. bersungguh-sungguh. Mm. Nah, kalau kita nak buat benda mudah yang sensasi. Ikhlas. I think the word is ikhlas. Ah, ikhlas. Bukan yeah. untuk duit. Kita kena ikhlas lah kita mm. nak tolong orang oh, Islam mm. ni. Bukan dengan sensasi politik mm-hmm. ya, Bucap itu dan ini mm-hmm. ya, Tukar schedule nine lah, mm-hmm. Masukkan itu masuk, mm-hmm. Itu senang lah, Cakap mm-hmm. But you Nak drafting itu pun susah Datuk 
<laughs> yes, yeah, well, let, let them sort it out lah. Tapi <laughs> let them draft lah. Mm. Tapi maksud saya ni, perbaiki sistem yang ada. Mm. Itu lebih baik. Mm, betul. You don't think betul. so? I, I agree. Agree with you. Yeah. Mm. Okay, ini Alice. We have another short break, mm-hmm, okay. and then uh, we have a uh, last segment in another few minutes. Okay, sure. Thank you. <laughs> 